Hey everybody, hope you're having a great and wonderful day. I am back here. Finally, I got my hands on this Bowman's Best from 2021. It was a little bit delayed, um, especially to me. I know I'd seen it out there. I think a couple people had gotten their stuff, but it really was uh, across the country. It was really slow to get out. And finally today, um, even though they didn't get all their cases, I at least got to, uh, since mine was a pre-order, I uh, got my box from uh, my LCS. So if you guys hear any noise in the background or some talking, I got my boys hanging out. It's their last day before they go back to school. And we're just kind of hanging out and they wanted me to, to open this up. I will say this is... Uh, a little bit higher end for me, um, but definitely got some Christmas money, and so that kind of really helped uh, me uh, be able to buy this. But a uh, very cool thing. This is the first time I've ever, ever opened up a Bowman Be Bowman's Best box, um, and so this is be really cool and exciting for me. Um, if you've never seen it before, there are two mini boxes inside um, what they call, consider the hobby box, and um, each mini box will have two autographs in it, so there'll be four total autographs. There is six packs per the mini box, so 12 total, and five cards per pack. Um, we got Austin Martin and Vladimir Guerrero Jr. So this is kind of a mixture of um, Major League Baseball players and then a few um, kind of prospects. Um, a lot of the rookies, they'll all be in here. And uh, it's just a really beautiful looking product. Um, and so we're going to open it up. We're going to stop talking. We're going to get going here. We're going to open up this master box here and we're gonna then there's your four chrome autographs these are all chrome cards so they they look absolutely amazing um just my some of my favorites um are chrome cards which i believe is probably some of the of yours as well so let's get going this is box number mini box number one oh, excuse me i'm feeling much better than from the last video that i shot um but, uh, yeah, I'm just, <laughs> thanks for dealing with me in that last video if you watched that. Um, but definitely feeling better getting past that. You know, this size of this box right here is probably what a blaster box should be. Like, I mean, um, they do such a blaster box. There's such kind of a waste of uh, space. Um, but let's get going. Like I said, there is the patch right there. It looks exactly like the outside of the box. This is a hobby only product, so you will not find this on your retail shelves or anything like that. But let's get going. Super excited. Let's see, we've got a Bobby Witt Jr. there on the back. So this is what the cards look like. They are super. They are shiny. They are awesome. They look amazing this year. Um, very, very cool. I like that. I like how the, the uh, logo is kind of in the back there. Let's take a look at the back right there. And that's kind of what they look like. Just a little bit of uh, information about each player. We got a rookie card of Jimenez, and I don't believe that's like a green or anything. Um, I think that's just the card color. A beautiful card there. We got a nice Bobby Dalback rookie card. Here's one of the inserts. This is Future Vibrance. Um, Pagero. <laughs> uh, there is the back, what that looks like right there. And then we've got the Bobby Witt Jr., which, man, that is an awesome-looking card right there. Oh, it's a refractor, too. So that's cool. They do tell you that it's a refractor. Very, very awesome. Like that. Love these cards. Love the looks of these cards. Um, I guess the big news is, is that, uh, if you haven't heard yet, is that, um, you know, uh, Fanatics did go out and they did buy tops. So uh, very excited about that. Really happy. I think we all kind of knew it was coming, but... Um, really excited that the tops and the Bowman brand and the Bowman name and the tops name will carry on. Um, so very, very excited about that. I hope Fanatics just kind of lets them do their thing. Um, but we will see. Um, I don't know if it's going to be a great thing that Fanatics bought it or a bad thing. We will have to see. There's a nice Blaze Jordan right there, just a regular base card, but um, just an amazing looking card right there. Got a nice Ronald Acuna Jr. We've oh we got it oh we got a fire die cut, very very cool. So we got us an Austin Martin die cut. Uh, these are looks like they are. If I can go back down here and read them real quick, where did I see that? I want to tell you the right information. Um, they are two per case. So, and this, oh, no, wait. Okay, I'm going to tell you right now. I believe this is a rookie. 
Oh, a Bowman. Oh, what, what, there's so many different things. So this is, I can tell you right now. So this is Austin Martin. Obviously, it looks like an Atomic. Um, so let's go down here to, um, I'm going to make sure, I want to see what this card is. So let's go down here and actually look. Um, Vibr I think this is a, what, what is this? Uh, HW26. Nope, that's not it. Um, Austin Martin. Oh, Heat Wave Die Cut Atomic. So it is two per case. So we got really lucky by hitting that. That's a really looking, cool looking card. Look at that. But these Heat Waves are two per case. Very awesome card. Um, very, very cool card. Now, the hard part is, and I'll do this on screen, is sleeving this these die cut cards. And actually, that wasn't that bad. Okay, so I built up a lot of drama for nothing. But um, very, very cool card right there. Awesome card. And then we got some nice Alex Kirilov. And this looks like a refractor. And it is nice rookie card. So like you're seeing, there's 100 cards in the set. Um, so not a lot of cards in the set. Um, and then we still haven't seen our autograph yet. We should get two here. So I've got to say that we're going to possibly get one of our first autographs in this box. So looks like we got a green parallel coming up. Uh, looks like Mercedes um, rookie card. We got a set of Miguel Cabrera. I believe this is a green parallel. I do not see. Did I miss it on the front? Oh, yeah, there we go. So it's this is out of 99. They're really hard to see. But a nice Fernando Tatis green out of 99. And then our first autograph is Tyler Stevenson. Nice rookie auto right there. On-card autos on these. This is, that's an awesome looking card. Nice uh, catcher um, for Cincinnati there. And then uh, catcher refractor of Joey Bart as well. So, very cool. We got our first auto. We'll take it. Uh, as long as they're not pitcher autos, I enjoy it. <laughs> uh, it's. Uh, I will take four position players anytime. So we got us a Josh Donaldson there. Kyle Lewis. Uh, Jose Barrero, rookie, Cincinnati. Uh, future vibrance of Pedro Leon. And then a Vladimir Guerrero Jr., refractor man these cards are amazing it's a bummer that we can't talk about actual baseball stuff happening um it, it's unless it's all negative it seems like uh there's nothing good coming out of baseball they still haven't uh figured out anything there's nice julio rodriguez still haven't filled, figured out anything about the lockout or anything like that um nice jared kelnick rookie card awesome looking card there oh Okay, um, all right, so now we've got another rookie card, Fire Cut. You know, I wonder, so these are 25, that is an, that's a Heat Wave die cut. Um, I guess, so this just says it's in one in every six packs. So, if I went up here, it did show me, oh, two Heat, oh, Man, there is a lot of information here. Um, I thought they were per case, but maybe they are. I don't know. We'll see. But that's a really awesome refractor. Andrew Vaughn, fire, vibrance one there. And then a Carson Williams. I'm not going to be honest. I have not heard of him before. He is a shortstop refractor there for the Tampa Bay Rays. And then we got our last one here, and this should have an autograph in it. Um, but the, yeah, the, the uh, still uh, in the lockout, still nothing happening. They've got to figure this out soon. We're already into January. I do not want the regular season delayed. So JT Real Muto, uh, Andrew Judge. Ooh, nice, beautiful card there. I think our auto is next. So let's do this. We got a Brady House, who I've been uh, pulled uh, two of his cards out of the um, Bowman draft and uh, got a lot of comments about how he's going to be a good one. Um, so uh, I'm going to have to, I'm getting quite a few of his cards, so maybe he's going to be a, definitely be a good one there. So we got Andrew Vaughn right there, a really cool looking card. Uh, rookie craftsmanship, uh, very, very awesome. Let's see what our auto is. 
and it's a Tanner Murphy. So these, uh, let's see who this is. I have not heard this Tampa Bay player either. He is another shortstop, so it's a refractor auto. Um, <clears throat> not even a rookie card. It looks like it's uh, more of a um, uh, prospect card. But uh, you guys have to let me know, you Tampa Bay fans, um, if he is any good. But uh, two nice. We'll get. We'll take two rookie or prospect autos out of this. So let's see if we can get uh, something even better out of this box here. So second mini box. All right, all the cards are gone there. Two, three, four, five, six packs. Okay, we got a nice Louise Robert there. Nice Jonathan India rookie card. Here, rookie of the year, National League Rookie of the Year. Ooh, that's a nice one right there. We got us an Atomic Shoei Otani. Very, very, very cool. Those Atomics are really cool looking. And then we got us a Pedro Leone Refractor. It's our second Leone card there. Cody Bellinger, who really needs to have a bounce back season next year. Um, he was such a talented player, and I just think injuries have really driven him down. But I really hope he comes back. It'd just be really good for baseball because he is such a talented player. Um, that's not numbered or anything. It's just kind of a nice Lindor there. We got it. There's our next numbered card right there. Very, very good one. Nice rookie card of Key Brian Hayes, and looks like our auto is right there. So we're going to look at this. Refractor of Albert Pujols. Um, obviously looking for a team still. He's a free agent. And uh, um, we'll see where he ends up. This is called something. Um, I don't know. It's some kind of refractor thing. Uh, let's see what we got. So this is a Aqua Lava, I believe, because it's out of 199. So those are really, really cool looking. And our third auto is... Uh, another guy I've not heard of. So another uh, looks like a prospect for, um, sorry, I handed that other card off. Uh, looks like a prospect for the Milwaukee Brewers. And it looks like maybe he dropped his pen and uh, just scribbled on there. That's one, um, uh, one kind of autograph. Let's just say that. Um, but there's our third guy. He is a catcher for the uh, Brewers. So yet another prospect auto i'd love to hit a major league baseball player auto i know tyler stevenson played last year but i'd love to see a big name auto in this for our last one but this box has been pretty awesome they have a lot of amazing looking cards in there buster posey who is now retired and enjoying uh, life after baseball Contreras, sam bachman a uh, nice blaze jordan future vibrance card i don't know if i showed the back so yeah i think i did on the other guy uh but those are cool that's a cool looking insert right there and then a keyboard keybert ruiz right there in his nationals uniform so that's very cool not in his dodgers uniform anymore <clears throat> all right that packed up the weird so let's make sure we get the cards out of here in a good way guys say jordan alvarez on the back there's Spencer Torkelson. Uh, looks like he is almost making his way up. Um, Going to possibly be up next year. Um, so really looking forward to watching him play with Detroit. Detroit's building a really nice little team um, there. So it's very cool. Well, Zach Veen, another uh, prospect there for uh, the Rockies. Uh, got another Key Brian Hayes, which is his regular rookie card. Got us another one of these uh, fire... Um, so I just wonder, sometimes I think that maybe I'm looking on Cardboard Connection um, and they talk about these fire cards here. And um, I just wonder if it's too. It's never super clear about what it is, but um, maybe it's just two per box or three per box and then maybe one Atomic Fractor per case I'm not exactly sure i'm going to dig in to see how rare these are but very very cool another fire one of 
uh, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. I just was not uh, expecting to see um, as many as I did in this box. And then we got this nice Jordan Alvarez right there. So we got two more packs. And like I said, we are hoping for another a really big auto coming up. Uh, we got the Glaber Torres right there. I wonder if he's going to move over to second base like everybody is talking about. Nice Jacob DeGrom. Got an Andrew Vaughn. Um, looks like there's our auto right there. So let's do this. Uh, nice Alex Manoa. I watched him pitch his first baseball game. Nice refractor there. I really like him. I think he is going to be a really good pitcher. Um, nice Andrew Vaughn rookie. And our last auto is Luis Rodriguez. So I'm still learning a lot of prospects. I think he's a pretty good name. I don't know if he's a top name. But that autograph is really nice. Look, he's got a beautiful autograph. And it looks like this has got a green one. So it is out of 99. So that is probably our best autograph of the entire box. Luis Rodriguez, green to 99 auto there. So lots of prospects. Lots of uh, um, one that one of those rookie cards there in our autos. So very, very cool. Um, no big major league baseball player or anything like that. But let's just see what's in our last pack. Maybe we'll get something... Uh, pretty cool. J.D. Martinez, Christian Pache, rookie. There's another Alex Kirilov. Got us an Austin Martin, future Vibrance card. Um, these cards are really, really cool. There he is in his Twins uniform. And then we'll finish it off with a Spencer Howard, our rookie pitcher for the Texas Rangers. So that's really it for right now. Um, let me do one thing. I'm going to box up. I'm going to box up. I'm going to sleeve up this Vladimir Guerrero here. And then we'll just kind of look at these. So we got us this Vladimir Guerrero. We got us our here, our autos right there, that Rodriguez uh, Quiro. Um, this is uh, numbered out of 199, that uh, Key Brian Hayes, Tyler Murray, and then Tyler Stevenson. And then we got us another one right there. And Austin Martin. I know we had another one in here. We had a Tatis Jr. Where did he go? Let's he put him in the pile, so I put him back in the pile. That's okay. That's okay. Um, you would think that it would stick out. There it is. There he is, the Andrew Vaughn uh, one right there. Let's go ahead and sleeve that up, too. Um, so we'll have to see the rarity of these. Um, they're obviously not per case like uh, that I was reading. Uh, maybe it is the Atomic. Uh, one is one per case. But... Uh, I would say an overall pretty good box. I don't know for sure. Maybe time will tell if it's a great box. Um, but it was definitely a, a fun box to open. And uh, hope you enjoyed it. Um, hope you had a great New Year's. Everybody stay safe out there. We will talk to you next time. See you later.